Um, one other question um, you said about the taking the the, uh, the napkins to wipe your face. Can we use like a like a like a what do you call it? Uh, like a wipe, a wet wipe. Mm, no, no, that so that's, I apologize. That's um, that's not what what I meant. Uh, what what I meant. So uh, if if I. Uh, Tell me if, uh, if that that's what you're referring to. Uh, we were talking about Yom Kippur that that is coming. So on, on Yom Kippur, one of the things, one of the five things that are forbidden is to wash to wash our body, right? So even even the face we're not uh, we're not allowed to wash. So for some people, I know a few people who who, who go crazy, not from a not fasting, but from not brushing their teeth. They go. Crazy for them, it's the biggest torture. You understand? So, so, and of course, so, so what, what I said when, when you wash your hands only up to the first knuckle, right? That, that's what we said. So, you, you can wipe your uh, your eyes with the uh, remaining of the water. That, that's what I said. So, I mean, it's it's not a lot, not a lot of water, but it, it's, it's enough to fresh, uh, freshen up your eyes a little. It, that is it, what that, that, that's what you meant, or? Yeah, so that's like the minimum that we can use to yes. wash our eyes. Exactly. Have you. Okay, exactly. so we can't use like a, a baby wipe or nothing. No. No, no, nothing that we have because there is a, no, the, no, no. there's no. a moisture. You're right. There is okay. a moisture there. Okay. Okay, and another thing too, um, with it being you know a young people and we can't you know wash our mouths and, and our faces and stuff. Um, we're allowed to say the prayers and and oh, that's our, our, uh, yeah, exactly exactly uh, that's a uh, that's a very good a, point. It, 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 yeah. yeah yeah yeah, it's a uh, it's exactly good. It's it's a very good point because I would say just say you're not allowed to, to, to pronounce Hashem's name with a, with a dirty mouth, right? That you, you it's a good point, but in in this case. Uh, we, we, don't, we don't do it out of laziness or something, right? We do it because uh, our sage said, our sage said, that's that's the rules of the day. That's it. So we just follow the rule. So you, you're right, 100%. Uh, on, uh, on all other days, it would be not, not, not appropriate, right? So that that's why, that's why. Even though in uh, Shulchan Aruch, it says, uh, so like, say, uh, do, 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 do all of these morning blessings, like, Right away, so you you wash your, your hands. You say, you say the blessing. Uh, you 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 do this. Uh, you you get up. You you sit up on, on your bed. You say the blessing. You you stretch up. You say the blessing. You you put your clothes. You say the blessing. So um, all of these short morning blessings. That's what I'm referring to. That's what Shulchan Aruch says. But actually, uh, we do it uh, in our cedar, like uh, after we wash uh, brush our teeth wash our face, whatever we need, need to do, and we're ready 100%, and only then we say all of this blessing, including the blessing after the restroom. That's uh, that that's what we do today. You understand? Because why? Because you now you properly dress, and you're in state of mind, to, and you you, you you completely prepare for the, for the prayers. Right? So today is a little different. But in, in olden days, people did not, did not brush their teeth. We, we just have to know. Right? Many people did not wash their uh, faces, and only Jews uh, wash their hands before eating. Just so you know, right? That's why when it was uh, it was a black plague in uh, Europe, and uh, I think the thirty percent or I don't know how many percent, forty uh, percent of Europe actually died from this black plague. So they uh, they blame it on the Jews because why? Because the Jews uh, did not have uh, so, so many deaths. Why? Because we have a halacha that you must wash our hands before before the meal, and it's forbidden to drink after somebody else from the same cup, right? So they say don't drink after it's a halacha, don't drink after your fellow because it's a poison. So of of course at that time nobody knew about bacteria, nobody, right? The microscope they invented uh, uh, I don't know, much much later. A few hundred uh, years after that, right? But we, we just follow the halacha. 
you understand so we always knew about washing our hands but other people but uh, it was normal not not to brush their teeth so that, that's why it's not said uh, in uh, in uh, in Shulchan Aruch.